Even though humanity is failing on its climate policy objectives, this means that extreme weather will still impact the normal global life and some evil state will also weaponize its outcomes. And when people in the streets of New York and other cities of the world went out on climate protest, we all have seen them. And when people in Morocco and Libya and other countries die as a result of natural disasters, and when islands and countries disappear underwater, and when tornadoes and deserts are spreading into, into new territories, and when all of this is happening, one unnatural disaster in Moscow decided to launch a big war and kill tens of thousands of people. We have to stop it. We must act united to defeat the aggressor and focus all our capabilities and energy on addressing these challenges. As nukes are restrained, likewise the aggressor must be restrained and all his tools and methods of war. Each war now can become final, but it takes our unity to make sure that aggression will not break in again. And it is not a dialogue between the so-called great powers somewhere behind the closed doors that can guarantee us all the new wars era, but open war of all nations for peace.